Yeah, exactly. Which is the optimal play. Yeah, the like, mm -hmm. it's, probably, it's like fair to assume that you know, they're gonna have more uh, farms later in Oregon with Oregon stuff, but this is my favorite tribe to play on Tiny Dry Land. It's really fun, actually. Do you um, actually have a uh, strategy that you use? I really would like to learn it. Archers, either that or roads. There okay. is no middle ground. There's the no archery is low. the archery archery is really sweet because it's just super efficient, and they don't really have the money to go for other options. The thing with any other path is like, if you are getting riding of any sort, it needs roads. Otherwise, they move one tiles or one tile, but even with that, that's usually a front load for rooted tridents, which are really efficient, but Ooh. normally in most games, for like price and aid and villages and what space you're on, you go for archers. Yeah, that makes sense. On larger oh. games, it gets a little more interesting, because you start bringing like tridents into the game as well, but for Tiny, you're probably not going to see those as much. Like The game should be decided yeah. well before then. And then if there's a Orgs or farms, then you like maybe consider going for defenders. Archers. Because if you don't have a good economic tech that leads into archery, you kind of need a way to defend yourself. And if you can get a walled defender, then you somewhat have that time. Also, nice like, uh, you don't really have a lot of counterplay if like your opponent gets like a crab on like turn seven or eight, yeah. which is you know. For Aquarium. Has the but, next one actually been posted, or is this just right now the only game that's being played? There are plenty of games being played right now. Is, uh... Anyway. So Estrella got that Estrella. middle village, right? Yeah, this is the uh, locked it down. This is also why you kind of want to be really conservative with your initial warriors. Because on a tribe that doesn't have quick path to riders, etc., you are very dependent on your first few warriors getting somewhere important. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm assuming he went org here just because he can't upgrade that second city with uh, hunting. But still Which disappointing. Valid, but also, I would probably still get archers there. Like yeah, because the level city. one city you can defend is a lot more valuable than the level two city you can. Especially if you have archers, which allows you to translate that to other villages or aggressive pressure. Yeah. So since the whole talk of trying to go with archers as a main strategy, that definitely takes uh, crabs out of the picture, I'm assuming. Well, if you have enough resources, you can go for it. Just typically, Aquarion does not have an easy path to crab, so it's sort of ignored. Oh, yeah. If you have, like, a bunch of farms on your city, like, it's still really hard to get the crab just because of how much it costs. But there's times, depending on... Uh the resources and ruins where crabs are viable. It's just Aquarium is not a very resource-dense tribe. Estrella went for yeah, or a, a bunch of variance in its resources. Yeah, just upgrade both these cities. Also for Defenders, which... Defenders there are... we go. Defender and Cloak is actually a really good combo. Now, this, yeah, okay, so Astra oh, sees this. that uh, there's the, like, uh, forest defense bonus for that warrior. Uh, and knows, knows that it, the yeah. alpha's got archers, so he goes to the But he's kind of on mode. limited time, because now <laughs> the alpha can do something really sweet with his warriors, where if he moves the warrior in a certain location, he can threaten both the village. No! He should have moved that south, that way he could have threatened the village. Yeah. If he was able to threaten yeah. the village, then he would have like really nice control over most of the map. That would have been the real big play with archery, because then he can get the village very easily. He could threaten the city as well. But now Australia will take that and have a majority of the map, which is kind of a shame. 
Yeah, like, it's gonna take him some time to go down and get that uh, village down in the south, but as soon as he does, before a city is against three, Asgir can defend in this position. And yeah, then especially if he got... Off, but can... What is it? No, there's no farms in that city, so it's slow to a wall. So in some sense, the Alpha can defend it, but also all his units are going in other directions. It will be much harder for him to generate momentum that way. Yeah, it all depends on... Uh, the Alpha's going to have to make some aggressive plays here. I uh, definitely think the Warrior South onto the forest, whatever turns ago that was, was the big play. Yeah. Because you can somewhat infer a village there based on the resources. Especially since Aquarion is a lower resource tribe, so even on dry land, if you see something, you're like, this is probably a village. And you know that because you're looking all around, see all those blank spaces that aren't in villages, even in the villages. Oh, absolutely. You see a fruit and you're already thinking, maybe that's a resource, or maybe that's a village. I think there's a yeah. village on the corner of the map right over there. Like every single tile that is not adjacent to a village looks like a field tile. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's one nice thing about picking up organization, just so you have an idea about fields. Especially on tribes that don't like spawning fields as much. I like those uh, little bits of extra information that you can get. Yeah. But uh, sadly a lot of tribes don't like picking up uh, organization. Because it typically is a dead end uh, pick. Unless it's something like Yadak that would have a lot of farmland. Needs to hit this archer, advance the warrior, and get more art for what? Okay. Please chop. Yes, sir, that was the correct play. Now make more units. What I miss? <laughs> I'm actually only looking from uh, Astria's view, so I haven't been looking at uh, the Alpha. To chop and get an archer in his capital. Please. And then with climbing, he can guarantee the city in the south. This is This is part of the beauty of archers right here. Oh, yeah. Well, actually, the Shreya can just go for a defender in the east, which makes it a bit slower. Never mind. Oh, well, that's a bummer. What text does Astria have? Uh, defending and then also hunting. He didn't go past hunting, did he? No, he, he only has three texts. Yeah. You need. He didn't go defender. Okay. That was a misplay. That was a misplay. The alpha can buy yeah, climbing. He's, he I doesn't mean, even need climbing. He the units that. No, but yeah, if he goes he's... climbing, he can also get the ruin. The only thing is it lowers his uh, unit production. But still. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that, that gives up a city. That city's gone. This is the beauty of archers. No, no, don't. don't go for the siege. Go for the siege. Or, I guess, explorer's fine. He gives him info. He knows. Yeah, yeah, now go for the siege. <laughs> if he if he just does, decides no, I don't want that village the here. I don't know how I'm gonna respond. You right can now. move your you can move your warriors first, but just go for the siege. Move the uh, warrior and see what's going on. Probably doesn't have because uh, he would be investing all of his troops. I'm assuming that means well, I don't see his view right now. No. Does he have oh. Oh, oh my, that is a shame. I, he just didn't want that city. Bruh. He just didn't want to win. It, he, uh, did they also play? He moves it from that, I'm gonna crop. Did they play in the first bullet tournament? Yes, he did. Also, the alpha of them did, yeah. The alpha, what are you it, doing? It Why could are you just doing this to my heart? heart? It could did just the alpha chop in that city with a ruin? Maybe yeah, he just didn't want to win. Why well, uh, take the city when winning. I could not? I mean, he still got the archers though. Astria hasn't made any progress on that city in the I southwest. Think his archers are in a weird position, so if Astrea went for a defender, then he couldn't stop it. Plus, a uh, warrior is just in a bad position, so like, bruh. 
Yeah. So it's not bad. They're still on three versus three, and the Alpha has better units, but he's kind of doing some weird stuff with them. Well, also with that weakened uh, Warrior, unless uh, he really tries, unless uh, Alpha Omega tries to push more units, I would probably assume that Astria would use that weakened Warrior to start heading over to that village. Yeah. What, what are you doing? Why was he looking at the tech tree? Now's a good time to be picking yes. up. Yes. Yes. Could we be going for a map? I wouldn't smart. Kill him. <laughs> if you pick up the strategy tech, you could offer the opponent peace and uh then pick up meditation for five turns of peace. This is like thinking way many turns ahead. Well, Estrella already has strategy, so if he wanted, he could go for cloaks. That's true. He also could be going for cloaks, but uh, just that cloaks have lower viability against a, a tribe with less city levels. Plus, he has archers, so you could just shoot yeah. them. I hear you, Cleo. What is it? You want to play? Talking to the Sparkies. I just got a apologies. You can still siege, right? Yes. Well, he's playing. I mean, he's got to decide character. that he wants to this time. <laughs> I mean, Astra is uh, like he has all the materials he needs to siege, and also ensure that a. Uh, the archer can't unsiege. He just needs to do it. Archer, right? Did he yeah. buy archer? Yeah, he bought climbing. He's going for it. Let's go. This Three. makes me happy. Shoot him. Um, nice. Oh no, because yeah, he's one health um, short. He needs it to be eight health. That word to be eight health to siege. Fade. Uh, defense boost to defender, yeah. I mean, he still has archers everywhere. Yeah. He didn't lose anything and on Astria that exchange. Has, like, no units. The thing is, the archers took no retaliation damage, as they always do, so, like, he has the grip on him. Yeah, Astrid, like, doesn't have a way to respond. Well, they he's more like defender but... in the west, but, like, the units are... archers defend the west. This is the thing is, like, the second those defenders step off the village, they're not going to do anything. Archer moving uh, southeast was a good play for Estrella. Is definitely in control. What's that? More defenders. All right, the Alpha has a very difficult decision to make here: siege city or not. He can do it if he wants to. But go I, don't through. Gonna to. I don't think he's gonna do it. You just attack the like kill off the archers and step on it with the warrior. And then use the warrior to kill the other defender. Oh yeah, that archer isn't at full health, so he can I think he can kill the warrior here. Yeah, but he has a veteran warrior. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah. Too easy for guys like us. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Get the siege. Get the siege. <laughs> do it, do it, do it, do it. We're all rooting for you. Come on, buddy. Yeah. What? Oh. Oh. Why is he doing this? Uh, 
he had what? to decide that he wanted it. Oh my god. Do you want to put on your capital, maybe get some crab potential going? Okay. What? I guess I <laughs> wanted to train the more crack? units there. Why? I don't understand a thing that's happening on my screen. My either. brain. This is what happens when you play Aquarion on Tiny. No, this is what happens when you play Weird. Sometimes I would be watching PewQ's game and then like misread like what he was going to do. He would like disagree with me, but I always understood what he was doing uh, when I saw him play. Uh, I I don't know what the decision was there. Me neither. Why would you what? Why would you let that happen? Like, you could have sieged him, take I one think, of his cities. I think no. B is uh, running out of gas in the tank after a long uh, GMT Yeah, roller. that's kind of what he said about, like, after his last game. What were his exact words? He's lost all his power cells. He's really not here. Yeah, yeah, brain power yeah, clearly not here. Yeah, and now he and now he's getting a wall. This is, this is what uh, happens, bro. He didn't. Why didn't he, he could have been had two cities of his. The wall decision is isn't over. Isn't as complicated as a lot of people make it out to be. It's just, what do you value more? Uh, Winning. It's <laughs> just shoot defender. Siege, win game. What? Well, <laughs> what are you doing? Okay, just like if you can't Go break through the catapults this, or something like, at this point, jeez. Yeah, you need just make some way that you can break through, and if you can't break through on the units you have, just get a crap or like find some way to upgrade your city. The thing is, like. He built a warrior last turn instead of an archer, and he didn't get siege. He would be able to build a catapult in the capital, and then he could uh, very easily just uh, harass that uh, defender. Because even a wall defender won't stand if you start stacking catapults on it. Yeah, I can't. My brain hurts. Why? What do you mean, why? You just gotta, like, you just gotta find some way forward and commit to it. But it seems like they're, uh, trying to play so that the game lasts forever instead of, like, you know, ending it. <laughs> well, our moment. Alrighty, I gotta go play. See you later. Astria had such a good position earlier on, too. It's not like, uh... He's playing terribly, like, the wall is, like, fine to, like, ensure that uh, the Alpha doesn't take... Yeah. City, the Alpha like, is thinking of smithery. Bruh. Like, it's fine for this position, but you didn't need to be in this position. You would have just seized. Just, like... <laughs> okay, Rose isn't bad either. Oh, is that what I think it is? Yeah. Go for it. Come on. Yeah. Alright, that we can end this game right now. Game. That's game. That's yeah, game. Yeah, Astria can't push that. He can't kill that, so. Finally, let's go. That I like that in turn. That made me that happy. Was... I thought he was gonna yeah. choke that game. 
that was worth the wait. He decided he didn't want the East City because he didn't need it to take the capital, so. What a man. <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> well, it's time for me to jump into uh, my Aquarion game. Have, uh, I cannot game. believe it. Somebody this should so undeafen the alpha. Okay, now it's over. Yeah, I'm undeafening.